So Jared has volunteered as tribute to go back to the hotel and bring our bags down to the bag check, which needs to be done there by 11 because we paid for the round trip baggage service to and from the train station. So we'll be able to just go to the train station anytime before 9 p.m. and get our bags. How cool is that? Yeah. So George and I are gonna go to Adventureland because adventure yeah. is out there. Yeah. And last time we were here, it was like super duper rainy. Yeah. So I'm excited to like climb on stuff, yeah. see stuff not in the rain yeah. and have dry socks on. Yeah. Let's go. Nice socks are completely Ooh, there's that pirate ship. That's and that cool riding. swell. That's a jolly wagon. Whoa, okay, so should we go this way or this way? Okay, we'll go through that skull. Let's go to Adventure Isle. So this, which way do you want to go? You can choose. Oh, you want to go in the caverns? Okay. We're in it. Yeah. Want to go in here? Oh, okay. Right. Ooh. Oh, we're in the mouth. Oh, oh I goodness. can see the teeth. Oh, yeah. Whoa. You know what? That would be kind of a cute swimming pool on a really warm day. Yeah. Swim in the mouth of Skull Rock. Yeah. We're in the eyes and nose now up the stairs. Wow. That's fun. Uh -huh. Just a little skull rock walkthrough. You could come up here if it was rainy and like you could eat your lunch in the skull. Yeah. More dark cave time. Ooh. to the treasure. This is the bridge we want. I think we have to wait our turn. It's a wiggly bridge. Oh, it looks very wiggly. <laughs> Whoa! Wiggly! Good view of parts up there. Woo! It's super wiggly! Woo! We made it! Let's go find the uh, Cabin de Robinson. Oh, look who we spotted down here in Adventure Isle. It's Carl and Russell. They're about to go like on some kind of scouting adventure in that boat. Cool. I mean, they can definitely do that because they go around in a house. That's and when they're too low, they can do anything. Adventure is out there. Maybe that's why they're in Adventure Isle. Because they say adventure is out there. Yeah, right? and up. Adventure book. Mm -hmm. So this is probably their favorite part of the park, yeah. for sure. So now we're just trying to find the entrance to Swiss Family Robinson, the Cabin de Robinson. Um, looking for some signage. Let's see. That's it. Maybe? Yeah, that looks like it. Let's go around the bottom here. So there it is. I love a Swiss Family Robinson treehouse. That was one of my favorite movies when I was a kid, Swiss Family Robinson. And so like, I'm still really jazzed to get a chance to go in their house. I've always wanted to. Also, you know me, I like exercise. 
and it's like an excuse to um, walk up a bunch of stairs. That's Mo Waffles for me. Here we go. Ooh, like a band day Robinson. Here we go. Also, may I mention how glad I am that it's not raining right now. Hey! Oh, look at my algae. Oh, what happened? Even the Robinson family has to deal with algae. Ooh, look, let's stop right here. Our kitchen and dining room, complete with running water. Ooh, a volcanic stone art. Oh, and my favorite truck's the giant chill. Over there, buddy. I mean, for being on stranded on an island, they seem to be nailing it. Wow. Wow, that's where you. Well, that's where um, you and Daddy would sleep. Yeah, except for I, I would really like a larger bed if that's possible. Well, the kids' room is. Amazing. Yeah, you can have that. But they're only like camping. I love that they salvage, you know, a couple windows. Oh, there's more. It's even more up here. This is like, this feels slightly larger than the Swiss Family Robinson Treehouse in Orlando. So I will say that this part of the tree looks less real, but um, still fun. The Crow's Nest, Fritz and Ernst room. Fritz and Ernst, the brothers. So they have this in uh, Orlando too. Oh. oh, watch your step. There are three. I do the middle one. Three. Wow. Yeah, that's uh, that's a little tight. Everything is like mini. Maybe it's because I'm an American and we're giants. And also, they did. They lost most of their ship, so they couldn't salvage a lot. Of that's true, they had to make small stuff. Okay, here we go. Okay, it's time for Daddy to do a little thrill ride. And even though I wish Georgia could do this with me, I'm gonna have to do it and let her know. And you know, we'll come back to Paris, you know, when she's 12 or 10 and she's tall enough to do it. Let's go check it out. Here it goes up the hill. It says 10 minutes. This is great. I'm gonna Bradshaw line time this and see how long it is. <laughs> All right, the timer is set. Let's go. Nice. The, ooh, mosquito net bed. Nice. Now, the Indiana Jones ride in Disneyland is great, but this is a real roller coaster, right? I think this is gonna be like George's favorite roller coaster called Raging Spirits at Tokyo Disney Sea. Uh, we will see. I think it even has a loop. Cool.
was crazy. What a loop. That's fun. It's it's not that intense, but really a blast. I wish Georgia was tall enough. She would really have loved that. That did remind me of Georgia's favorite roller coaster, Raging Spirits in Tokyo Disney Sea. But there's a loop in there. Man, that is uh, intense. Do you have back or neck problems? That one is not for you. But that really was a 12 minute wait. It said 10 Bradshaw line time. Not bad. I recommend that one for the thrill seekers. And I'll have to bring back Georgia one day. <laughs> yes, that shirt is awesome. And I'm telling you, Adventureland here is so cool. With the caves and the paths. And you really don't know where you are. I mean, there's so many ways to go in it and around it. Very cool. Swiss Family Treehouse is very well done. It's awesome. All the pirate stuff. It's a great place for a kid to explore. And this playground that George is at, she's having a blast. Ahoy, we be going to the pirate playground. Let's see here. Where Georgia be? Hey Georgia! Hey buddy! Is this cool? What did you think of this playground? It was amazing. Good, I'm so glad. But there are a lot of spider webs. Oh, authentic Disney spider webs. Amazing. Yeah? Okay, I'll go find mommy. Look at the ship, man. I mean, that is awesome. Check that out. It's huge. Normally you can climb on it, but it is closed due to COVID. La Plage de Pirates. Arr, you can put a hat on. Hey, mommy! Oh, there she goes. Through the rock? Was that scary? Look pretty scary. Wow, look at the tree house. That's done. Wow. Really great theming there. Hey, bye, Adventure Isle. Restaurant Hakuna Matata. Well, we'll have to come back. Yeah. Okay, let's look over here. Look at the castle from here. I'm I got turned around. There's the castle. Ooh, what's over here at Cool Post? A Simba ice cream sandwich? This looks like a mushroom one-up, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright, we're about to have a pirate lunch at Captain Jack Sparrow's restaurant. Arr, here we go, shiver me timbers. Mon ami. There we go, and look! Jack is here. There he is. And look, we're here having meal at Captain Jack's. And there's Jack. Oh, marvelous. Hello, Jack. So good to see you, darling. Yes, hello, hello. Bonjour. He's like, bonjour, bonjour. All right, let's see. Let's see, Misty. Oh, yeah, smart, smart. Spooky in here. Ooh. Ooh, it's very dark back here. Oh, ho, ho. that's where the ride is, right? There's the boat going right through here. This is like in California, the Blue Bayou. Wow. Okay, so Georgia really wanted some chicken nuggets, and in French it's called pepit de poulet, right? Pepit de poulet. So we got a little yogurt, OJ, and Pepe de Poulet. And fries. Mommy is getting parents' food at Hakuna Matata, so we're gonna go meet her when she has that. All right, we found Mommy at Hakuna Matata, which means no worries here in France. I mean, I had a few worries ordering. This doesn't look like the, the picture. No. Mwah, Neither mwah, does my mwah. chicken and vegetables. But hey, you know, what you know can what you do? Though? It's pretty good. It tastes like chicken stew. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. There's some like lima beans. Mm -hmm. Hey, your nugs. Taste nuggerific. Pepito poulet. Wow, 
Pepito poulet. Pepit de poulet. Pepit de poulet. Yeah, like little pepites. Look, it's me and Hook. <laughs> Thank you, Hook. <laughs> oh, my goodness, it's me. Disney Dad Trivia, did you know the voice of Smee is the voice of the White Rabbit in Alice in Wonderland? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm late, I'm late. Look at that sign. Oh, five minute wait. This is what I'm talking about. Yes. No need for Bradshaw line time. Oh, it's a castle. You can tell this could be a really long queue. Ivachi land lovers, me hearties. I be stealing all your booty. Be nice to see if this one's updated any. Because everybody knows Pirates in California is way better than Pirates in Florida. But the best one, of course, is in Shanghai, so we can't wait to do that one. Okay. There's no line at all. Excellent. Pick up me, honey, go ho. Go ho. A pirate's life for me. You picked the right line. Excellent. Here in Oregon. Uh oh, we're going up a hill. Uh oh, it's like Splash Mountain. Here we go down the hill. Whoa. <laughs> Yes! Awesome! There's the redhead. <laughs> Never seen sword but hidden Mickey. Another hit. Oh, it blew up! It blew up! Wow! He's loaded the gun! Wow! <laughs> Look, he's drinking and it's all going through his neck. <laughs> okay, so this was amazing, right, Lens? Yeah, that was exceeded my expectations. That's the best pirates 
outside of Shanghai, I guess, because that one we is supposed to be mind blowing. Yeah. But that even beats the Anaheim, California. Mm -hmm. It was um, really great. There was like three hills. Like Georgia closed her eyes on the hills because <laughs> it was uh, really cool. Uh, Johnny Depp talked to us in French. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. There was a whole like separate grotto section. Yeah. <laughs> Um, where you go into this like dark cave with really a cool. skull with a black light pirate. Yeah. That was cool. He turned into a skeleton before your eyes. Check out this Mickey with the, uh, <laughs> the skeleton Mickey. 